Do you know any, notice anything different about me? Your sweats on the eaves, but different kind of sweats on the eaves. Yes. What do you think? Is that good? She's asking. Yeah, I think that's good. Okay. Yeah. That's great, huh? I love that. That's good. good. Come meet the twins. Whoa. Are your boys identical? Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. This is Mason. Mason? Mason. I'm Micah. So this is Talisha. Yes. And Talisha originally reached out to me and wanted a photo shoot for maternity because she's pregnant. Yes. And um, as we talked, I, I asked her more about herself and she told me that she has muscular dystrophy. Yes. And I said, you know what, we try to educate our girls and our kids on things they're not aware about, especially in regards to people. Talisha was very comfortable in saying, you know, we could shoot an episode where she could educate the girls about muscular dystrophy and what that is. Hi girls. Hi. How are you? Good. Do you know any, notice anything different about me? Your sweats on the eaves, but different kind of sweats on the eaves. Yes. So is this... A regular chair that mm -hmm. I'm sitting in? No. It's a wheelchair. It's a wheelchair. I can sit in your seat in the car, say the saddle. I have another special chair that's not a wheelchair. It's called a shower chair. If my chair is not working, I get I have to get carried. What's carried by who? Um, whoever's able to, like um, my husband. Or my mother. You're too heavy though. Are you too heavy? Um, well, that's why I have to be careful who, who carries me. Because they have to be able to be strong enough to... Try to not swap you. Exactly. If they not swap be... you, it, will be, it won't be good. It will not be it good. It will be worse than, than, than that in exactly. your legs. Your you're legs right. will get worse. That's so true. It will not be good at all. Why can't you stand up like us? Um, well, because I have a new muscular disease called muscular dystrophy. Mm -hmm. So basically, my muscles are not strong not like strong. yours are. Yeah. Like you might be able to, um, you know, pick up maybe a can of food. It might be a little harder for me. Yeah, so, so your husband do it? Um, yes. Or Sometimes I ask for help from other people. You, because you, you, you have to have some muscles. Exactly. Were you born with muscle deficit? I don't know. I said. <laughs> That's good. Good enough. Right. Wait. That was a good try. I was born with muscular dystrophy. When my mom, mommy was pregnant with me, I already had it before I was even born. But did you cry when you had it in your baby? I mean, you don't want that? I don't believe so. Why um, do you cry if you have it then? It doesn't hurt. That doesn't hurt? So yeah. you don't have to cry about everything? No, there's no reason to cry. Because I, I just sit in a chair. But I can do everything else like you can do. Like how you have a mommy. I'm a mommy. I have kids. But how you can walk if you're in a wheelchair? Because my job doesn't require me to walk. So as long as I can do things that don't require walking, I'm able to do it. Can you move your arms? Yes, I can move my arms. You can't pick up a big trash can. Exactly. Even though you like this, are you a happy person? I'm very happy, yes. But are you happy when you're a real sailor? Yes. Because, you know, I just sit in the wheelchair, that's it. What makes me happy is my family, my children, working, traveling. The important thing is that I'll always be able to have a happy life. You have a family, and that's what makes you happy. Exactly. Family is everything, right? Mm -hmm. Speaking of family, I'm expecting I'm having a baby. Having a baby. Another one. Another one. Boy or girl? 
I'm not sure yet, actually. Wait. I'm gonna find out very soon. It's going to be one or two. Just one. Just one. And your dad is gonna give me a photo shoot. What's a photo shoot? Take pictures. Photos of yes. you? Yes. And us? Yes, if you wanna be okay. here. So girls, mm -hmm. you girls were not in front of the camera now. Uh -oh. Instead, Talisha is going to have pictures and taken. And we are going to help her. You're going to help. Because you girls know how to take pictures, right? I'm zooming, acting. So girls, your dad is over there getting ready to take the pictures. So we're going to be here to help Talisha. We're going to be like her mirror. Her mirror? Yeah, so we can say, okay, that's great. But maybe she needs to turn a little bit to the side so we can see her baby bump. So first let's let your dad take his picture and we can see what the angle is and then we can help her out. Oh, that's Jersey's input. <laughs> can I show you what I got and you can help? She needs to go this way. She needs to turn, she needs to angle a little better. Maybe we'll see yeah. our baby bump a little better. Maybe, maybe if we have her face yeah. More, we have to ask your dad, I guess, too, if it's going to work. Like Face that more way. that way, right? Yeah. Okay. Face more that way. Yeah. No, no, that should be good. We don't want her looking at the wall. Count rodents Perfect. active. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay. She looks ready. Ready. So, Talisha, every time I take a photo, do you mind you know, doing something else, moving your hand in a different place or whatever? Uh, I think we're coaching over here, right girls? Yeah, yeah, yeah we're we've got this. Yeah. yeah. Dad is not coaching, he's <laughs> taking pictures. That's yeah. right. He's busy taking pictures of the yes. stuff and we're busy coaching the world. <laughs> we got girl business to do and he gets boy business to do. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> okay, now Talisha. If you can put your, what hand is this, girls? The right hand. Right hand. You put your right hand and put it down instead of on top of your belly. What do you think? Is that good? She's asking. Yeah, I think that's good. Okay. Yeah. Can you cross your arms in front more? Like almost like you're hugging the belly? Is that what you're saying? Now what I always do to you, I say, I'm gonna tickle you, and I don't even have to do it. That makes you laugh, just saying that. So ready, let's do it. I'm We're gonna tickle you, she's laughing. We're gonna tickle you. That's how you get a real smile out of somebody. <laughs> I like it. because of her disability, nor her wheelchair. See her for who she is, you know, for her spirit, mm -hmm. her low intelligence, and how she can hold herself. She's been raised to be a strong woman, mm -hmm. and I really do admire her about that. And she has raised me to become a better person as well. Despite my disability, I've always accomplished whatever it is I set out to do throughout my life. I've been fortunate enough to truly be living life to the fullest. Doctors would say that I'm disabled. While that may be true, I'm also a daughter, sister, friend, wife, and mother to two beautiful twins with one on the way. I couldn't have asked for a better life. Muscular dystrophy will always be a part of who I am, but never, nor will it ever define me. Okay.
Education. Thank you for watching.